Hi, I'm Danielle Sarasani, and welcome to The Circuit Breaker, the news roundup from IBM Research. First up, a huge week for Z Systems. Last week, IBM announced the newest generation of its mission critical mainframes, the Z17. The new system will bring powerful AI capabilities and workflows that must remain secure and on premise. At the heart of Z17 lies the new IBM Telem 2 processor and the IBM Spire Accelerator, both of which were born out of IBM Research. Spire is designed to handle the emerging AI workflows that Z17 clients will bring to the platform and is the result of years of research in the IBM Research AI Hardware Center. Spire accelerators will be available later this year as PCIe card add-ons. Next, using AI digital twins to make more efficient batteries. Electric vehicles have boomed in popularity across the world over the last decade, but finding new ways to make more efficient batteries so that consumers can drive for longer is still a very time-consuming process. IBM Research is looking at ways to speed that up with digital twins. By applying techniques originally developed for language models, our research created a framework for building AI-powered digital twins that are capable of accurately predicting complex system behaviors. Manufacturers can replace years of physical testing with highly accurate virtual models that predict battery performance and degradation under real-world conditions. At IBM, we're working with Germany's Sphere Energy to bring these models to battery manufacturers. That's just one area where these digital twins could dramatically speed up discoveries. Though, we still need to figure out how to get rid of traffic jams. And finally, exploring how the world makes medical breakthroughs faster. Cleveland Clinic's second annual Cleveland Discovery and Innovation Forum took place last week. Over 150 leaders from academia, industry, and government came together to explore advancements in scientific discovery. IBM has a long-standing partnership with Cleveland Clinic working to advance the future of medicine and patient care using some of the world's most advanced quantum and classical computers. The forum featured talks from IBM's Alessandro Curioni, VP of Europe and Africa and Director of IBM Research Zurich, and David Cox, VP of AI Models. At the event, Cleveland Clinic also announced that in collaboration with UNESCO, it will provide medical researchers in Africa with remote access to IBM Quantum System 1, located at Cleveland Clinic's main campus. For more on the latest innovations from IBM, make sure you subscribe to our newsletter, Future Forward. Until next time.